it's been a week since I played Satisfactory, which means that I'm only like months ahead at this point of where the recordings are. But I want to play at least one, just one episode's worth tonight, like one hour before I go to sleep at a reasonable time because I'm getting ready to go back into school. So I'm sleeping at night, waking up in the morning at like 8 a.m., which is pretty reasonable. 8 a.m. is good for me. I do not remember what I was doing in this game at all. Plus, it's good to just set the uploads to go overnight when I'm sleeping, which kind of works out. Oh, right, I had just expanded my iron, but I didn't actually hook it up to anything. Huh. I should have watched my previous video back. Were these doing something? You guys, what are you doing? Reinforced plates. These require a bunch of iron, a bunch of screws. There's no way I'm feeding these enough screws. That is my current problem. Getting these screws. All of them. Why? Why is this one, the plate coming in on the right? This one, it's coming in on the left. This one, it's coming in on the right. Okay. Because that's what I chose to do. Cool. I need to start getting these engines and these other things built as well. So as much as I do want to increase the steel production, it's going to take forever to build those two components. Maybe I should get them started. What were you doing again? You're the thing that's sending these sheets to these, which are someday going to make modular frames, which are going to be used to do things. What kind of things? All of the things. Okay, cool. Good talk. And my computer starts to overheat. But it's chill. Get out of here. All right, so what are we doing? I don't know. I also have to remember all of the keys. It's Q. We should play with the... Br Can you guys hear my computer beeping at me? Quit. It seems to depend where I am in the game. I could probably change my settings. Options. Video. Okay, chill, 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 chill. Custom texture quality. Instead of ultra, we could probably be high on a bunch of this. Confirm. Post-processing. That did make it stop beeping. Maybe that's enough? We'll see. Okay. And is there any visible difference? Probably not. Logistic. It just started beeping at me again. Oh no. Now I feel like I can see the difference. I don't know what the difference is, but it does feel worse. Or maybe it just became, like, brighter outside? No, it feels a lot worse. I'm gonna have to watch this video back afterwards. But, the game is not beeping at me. Huh. I might have to play with that. The problem is, I have to be recording. So I can't, like, end this recording, play with settings while I'm recording. I'll have to do it in between episodes. I will do that. This one might just look worse. Okay, what was I trying to do? We're gonna go. Production. Manufacturer assembler. Let's look at the assembler. I probably already did this, but let's do it again. Let's get a refresher. We want to make the things. Which things? The engines and the balls. What are the balls? Gyroscopic bearings of some kind? I don't know. To do that, manufacturer, this thing is massive. Oh, and I'm missing the heavy frames. Which are up here. Okay. Right, there's crouch jumping, but not uphill. I remember this. E, you have the frames that I'm looking for. It's kind of excessive. Cool. Ooh, we have the copper. It's still beeping at me. Why? Stop beeping at me. I changed all of the settings. I wonder if I have to change my recording settings. That would be painful. Stop. Okay. I did have other programs open. 
that might have affected things. I still have a couple things open, but nothing super resource intensive. Okay, we have a bunch of core temperatures. Max temp, why does this one show so high? I don't know how much I trust this software. Hmm. Okay, I closed more programs. I feel like it's still gonna have problems. It's still having problems. Why does my computer hate me? Stop, stop, stop. Options, video, graphic preset, custom, high, medium, low. Let's go to medium. Motion blur, upscaling method, none. Confirm. Resume game. It looks way different. Also, why does it... It looks so bad to me. Options. Video. Okay, what if instead of medium, we just go to high? High is similar to medium. I think the screen percentage went down from 90 to 75, so it's probably more zoomed in. Field of view, 90. Yeah, I'm gonna have to watch this back. Please, just work. Alright. In between episodes, I will play with that. Okay, just let me build this right there. Cool. So we want to make modular engines. They don't look that bad. 500 of these. Ooh, but they take 60 seconds a piece. So if I'm making these at 100% efficiency, we're talking about 500 minutes. These take two minutes a piece. They take computers. They take the heavy frames. They take all kinds of stuff. So these take more time. These take lots of stuff. I should set up these modular engines now. I really should. Okay, rubber smart plating and motors, which I'm not making yet. That is a little bit concerning. That is a little bit concerning. All right. What is this? What are you? This is my setup for something. Okay, get off of this. Where am I? God, I don't recognize half of my base. That. How do I not remember what that is? I remember building it. What were you? You're not copper sheets, are you? There's no way that's copper sheets. No, that's just rods. Is that just massive amounts of rods? That is screws. That is massive amounts of screws, which are getting backed up because we're short on other stuff. Ah, oh, screws are a pain to move compared to everything else. They just want a lot of belt space. I should be storing these excess screws, but maybe I should. I don't know. I don't know what I should be doing. I could be consuming those excess screws right now. I did not make that jump. Okay, forget about that. That's not what we care about. What we care about is building this next giant manufacturer thing. And where do I want to do that? And why do I want to do that wherever I want to do that? So this all, this all is making iron plates. Is that correct? No, this is making tons of rods and eventually it's going to make stupid amounts of screws, but screws are weird because they take up more space. Huh. Rubber comes in over there. I've already forgot what it needed. It needed rubber. It needed... I can't... My mind doesn't handle this much stuff all at once. Okay. 
So for this, it's just rubber smart plating and engines. To make the engines, rubber smart plating engines. Did I turn off the smart plating? I feel like I did. Or motors. You there. Smart plating. Isn't that hard? Okay, this requires rotors and stators. Rotors and stators. Okay. We're gonna need a bunch of stators. This game. It's way too much for me. I can't handle it. Circuit boards, plastic. Okay, that's not that bad. I mean, it's a good amount of plastic. And copper sheets. Okay. 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 We can do this. Can we do this? I do not actually believe that I can do this. It would be so much easier if I just built on foundations. It really would. I don't care what's easier. That would not be fun. I care what is fun when I'm playing video games. Primary importance. Having fun. That seems fun. Okay. So now. Modular engines. This is what we want. Smart plating. Motors. Rubber. Rubber. Smart plating. Those are two things that I might be able to just plug in. What is in here? This is a bunch of rotors. Okay. Smart plating. I feel like I disabled that. It's this box, isn't it? Yeah, but I have a stupid amount of smart plating. Do I have enough? I might. That is calculatable. I think I only need a thousand of it. If I only need a thousand of it. That doesn't seem that bad. Let's just plug it in. Let's just plug it in. And then we'll go from there. Cool. One thing plugged in. Power line. Where's your nearest power line? There have to be power lines going off to stuff. I see a power line right there, but that's not a good spot. We'll put this one right here. This one wants to be upgraded. Cool. It is upgraded. Now, it wants to be connected to where? There has to be a closer power pole than that. Floor is too steep. Oh, right. I'm trying to do the wrong thing. You? Can you not go that far? In Minecraft, shift is sneak, which slows you down. And control speeds you up. And in this one, control does nothing. I need to change my controls for different games so that they're all kind of the same. That one is full. There has to be one that's not full. You. Good. You're not full. Cool. We've got one input. Next up, we need rubber. Is that true? Or should I worry about making the motors? could worry about making the motors. To make the motors, we're going to hit 8. I would like to line these up with this second input. How does that look? Could have hit H. That looks beautiful. Cool. You're in there. How many motors do you need? You need two motors per minute. That's not very many motors per minute. Good. 
you can make more than two motors per minute. So I could supply these to more manufacturers, especially if I need 500 of these. We'll see. Rotor and stator. Rotor and stator. I know where I'm making rotors. I have no idea where I'm making stators. Okay. So rotors are right here, which is very convenient. How many of those do we make? Right now, none. We can make four per minute. Good to know. And I have a ton stored up. Perfect. You need to go where? Need to go into this thing. Cool. This thing goes into that thing. All of the things, all of them going into each other. So we said stator next. Good news is my computer stopped beeping at me, so that feels really good. We need 10 per minute of each of these. 10 per minute? Okay, luckily we have a huge backlog. Like more than enough, probably. If I was staters, I would be over here somewhere. No, not, yes. Holy, we found it. Five per minute. That's not enough, but again, we have tons in storage. Do we actually have tons in storage? We are already making motors. Holy, we have a whole container full. It's amazing. It's so good. Forget the other stuff. Okay. Wait a second. We're basically cheating. Bam. Forget that assembler that I just built. It's getting torn down. No. Okay. Cancel that. Who built this? Who did this? Because it is beautiful. All right, this wants to go this way. Quick, we don't want to keep loading those up. Because then I'm going to have to have all of those in my inventory. And that would be bad. Here, I'll just player is in the way. I'll cut that off before those get up to there. We're so zoomy. Can't I just pick these up? Pick them up. Okay, I picked up one. Okay, cool. Now, you go into here. Cool. Now all I should need is rubber. Why are these here? I swear I picked you up. Maybe I did not. Let me pick you up. What are you doing? It's not really there. It was a ghost all along. Okay. Motors. Motors are coming. Next up, we need rubber. Rubber isn't currently being used, so this is great. Because rubber could cause my power to shut down. If I was rubber and you were glue. All right. Rubber goes into a storage bin up there. Is that where I want to get my rubber from? Maybe. Someday, I'm gonna create a better way up to this first floor. I do have a ladder up. 
on the side of those storage containers for the concrete. And I should be taking that because this is not a good way up. But we did it. We're here. Look at that. Second floor. What are these? I'm already making these. These are automated wirings. Are they being stored somewhere? I don't think they are. I do not think that they are. I do think that maybe they should be stored somewhere. Staters. Okay. What are we doing with staters? Who knows? We're trying to get rubber. This is all steel, not plastic. If I wanted rubber, I don't think the rubber's being stored over here. What? Didn't plastic and rubber come from there? No. I remember where they come from. They come from over here somewhere. Plastic, rubber, I don't think I'm storing them over here. I should be. Especially because look at that plastic, it's missing stuff. Why is there a big opening in that plastic? Huh. Rubber is just backed up. Did I make that jump? I did. Okay, rubber, where are you going? No! Mistakes were made. If I was rubber, I would be... Right there! Going to nothing when it... It really needs to be going to something. Put it on top of that iron miner that currently does nothing. And then from there, we can go anywhere in the factory that we want, kind of. All right, where did I just put this? On top of that iron miner. From there, it could come on to here. It just joined back up with that plastic, which it split off from earlier. And then from there, building in this game is really good for how complex it is. Surprisingly good. Okay. All right, so now we're eating rubber, we're eating smart plating, we're eating motors. I should just make more than one of these. How are we doing for power? Power. Power is concerning, but I do have my batteries. I need to get those power switches that prioritize what power goes off first. Huh. Okay. How could this come back to bite me? This seems brilliant. This seems completely brilliant. That is exactly what we want in this world. We need a splitter. How many splitters? A bunch of splitters. Where do we need the splitter? Right here feels a little bit questionable, but not that bad. I thought that that rubber was flowing out of the back of this. Of course it's not. Bam. This rubber needs a splitter. Maybe the motors are more... No, the motors can split off anywhere. This is fine. Bam, good stuff. Next up, we need another splitter. Where would this splitter like to be? This splitter needs to be on this line. Right there, look at how good it is. Look at how good it is. This should be making 
Heavy modular engines. Cool. What am I going to do with the heavy modular engines? We're going to go plug them in to the space elevator thing. I hooked up all three components. Yes. If I look at you, why are you idle? Because you're waiting on rubber. And I can easily supply 30 per minute. We could be powering four of these machines. But it's going to take me a little bit of time to build the hundred of the other things because I do think I need to expand production of circuit boards or whatever. Probably. I don't know. Where am I going with this? Again, I don't know. My setup is beautiful. This one. That needs to go onto a merger. That merger can be... The stupid foundations are messing with this. What do you mean? Can't afford? In what world can I not afford? Can't afford. Conveyor belt is too long. Those are two different problems. Can't afford. That problem seems like the fundamental problem. Okay. Let's go get the stuff so that we can afford it. Get the stuff so that we can afford it. I know I have plates in a box right here. I probably have plates all over the place in other spots, but this is the spot that I'm choosing to go to. All right, let's get back to where we were. Where were we? We were up by the space elevator, kind of. Look at that, we're already producing. It's cool. We're already producing engines. Okay, this game, this game is hard. This needs to connect to right there, but I can't do it because that's too far of a shot, which is fine. Because instead, why do I have smart plating going up? Because I can. I remember. Because it was plugged into the space elevator until it wasn't. Got it. It all makes sense. We are now producing two engines per minute. Okay, you're doing your thing. 100 percent efficient how many spots does a box have i feel like it has 24 spots each holding 50 this is a double box it has three times eight which is 24 times 50 means that there's 1200 smart plating which is enough to make 500 of those engines okay cool next up Manufacturer. This manufacturer could be right over here somewhere. Look at how much space we have. Bam. That one can go right there. This one needs to be making these adaptive control units. Adaptive control units require 7.5 automated whatever things per minute. Five circuit boards a minute. That doesn't sound that bad. Some heavy modular frames and some computers. Bam.
Bam. Okay, good stuff. How are you on even though you can't do anything yet? This will eventually go up here. That means that I can ride the conveyor belt up. Okay, if I could jump on the conveyor belt, I could ride the conveyor belt up. Hmm. Player's in the way. Player is out of the way. Good jump! Heavy modular frame, computer, circuit board, automated wiring. I know I'm going to need to make more circuit boards, which is going to be a problem for plastic. To make circuit boards, we need, not a foundry, we need an assembler. To make these. I'm going to have to run plastic over here and copper sheets. circuit boards. You can make 7.5 per minute. That is plenty if I can feed you enough copper sheets and enough plastic. How are there still presents? Because today is only January 16th. I think tomorrow presents stop. I would like this gone. Except now I'm going to have stupid wood in my inventory. This is going to start a forest fire. Okay, you need copper sheets and plastic. Copper sheets and plastic. I already know that I have those being brought in, but I don't know if I have enough. The copper sheets, I'm sure I have plenty. Am I sure? I'm not sure, but I think I have plenty. If I was copper sheets, wouldn't my copper cave be over here somewhere? I can't wait for these Christmas gifts to be gone. If I was a copper cave, wouldn't I be could ping for it. That's a poison thing. I should make the things to blow up the poison things. Make the things. Make the explosives. Copper cave. Isn't the copper cave somewhere around here? What are you? You're the hub. Copper cave. Right down here. What am I doing with it? Like, am I just storing a bunch of copper? Jello! I've been paying for this jello in electricity this whole time. Okay, what do you have? You have so many copper sheets. And you're a double storage container. It's beautiful. How many of those per minute am I producing? I need to, like, write myself a sign that says, this is what goes into the cave, this is what comes out of the cave. The cave is beautiful. So the cave. Hey, purple thing. Hello, alien artifact. You produce 10 per minute. We're getting 60 of these per minute. Good to know. Just from the cave. But the cave might be the only place I'm producing them. 60 per minute. And I have a huge backlog. Ooh, they're not being supplied anywhere? Okay, then I must be producing them elsewhere, too, because there are machines that want those. 60 per minute. Okay. I think I can make signs, too. Could I make signs? Organization, transportation, walls, architecture. Foundations, trans organization. Logistics. Special. I might have to go unlock. Awesome shop. You require power. Whoa. 
welcome back. Sign. Five coupons. I don't have my coupons on me. Just let me buy it. Awesome sink. You require power. Fourteen coupons. Let's go. You're gone. You there. Sign. Label sign bundle. Display sign bundle. Maybe I just want the label sign. Plus it's cheaper. We can trash this one for now. Buy all. Cost to build. I don't have the stuff that it takes to build this. What does this one cost to build? No. I hate you. Okay. <sighs> Architecture? Where are stupid signs? Walls. Foundation. Special. Where are signs? Organization. New! I don't have the materials. How are we doing for time? 36 minutes. This is like an inventory spot that's always going to be eaten up by my sign-making stuff. Listen, this seems like a stupid small thing, and it kind of is, but it's kind of necessary if I'm going to increase the complexity to have some idea what, like, inputs and outputs are. And I might not get to play this game for a little bit because school starts day after tomorrow, and tomorrow I have other stuff to do a little bit. So if I can write notes to myself in the future, maybe that'll help us a lot, but maybe it won't. You there. I have so many coupons. We can be getting good stuff. 34 coupons? Let's go shopping. I'll save some for sure, because things are getting more expensive. But there's a billboard set. Okay, billboard sounds kind of cool. I don't think it's necessary yet, and it costs 10, which is kind of expensive. I do want lights. I do want lights. <sighs> Indoor lighting? It's not even that expensive. You're in. We're gonna need a light control panel if we're gonna have lights. Street lights don't care. Club lights don't care. Management. Management seems kind of good. Power outlets. I don't know if I need both of these. Like, why wouldn't I just go straight to Mark II? But then, why wouldn't I just buy Mark III's? Add to cart. Mark II seems sufficient, maybe. Um, clean pipeline. I don't think I care. I think I care about a bunch of this stuff, though. Inverted ramps, double ramp set. I still don't understand double ramp. Inverted ramps are pretty cheap. They seem helpful. Walls seem helpful. I would like gates. I would like windows. I would like these. I would like these. How are we doing? 24. Door walls are pretty cheap. Architecture would be so nice. I already got stairs. I could get modern catwalks. Look at how good this looks. Look at how good all of this looks. Steel pillar set. Steel beams is like steel pillars, just different. Industrial railings are really cheap. These look so good. Do they look so good? Kind of. We could buy a cart. We could buy that cart. Equipment. I don't need it. Parts. We don't need it. We don't need it. Customizer. I kind of want it. Glass roof material. 
Pathway patterns. How do I make pathways? Wait. This sounds good. All right, this is what I want. Buy it all. Okay, we already have 27 of those engines made. So yeah, they're gonna take a little while, but I get distracted easily, so it's not that long. We are coming over here to get our quartz, which I don't store, which feels weird, especially since it seems like I'm making excess quartz. You have to hit E for every one you wanna pick up. Oh, I could just go to a machine. Give me like, huh. Here, you can have that. I'll take, I'll throw this away. Give me that. There we go, 200, perfect. Perfect. Couldn't I just make this faster? Why is this a Mark 1? That feels wrong. Okay, Mark 4 seems like it might be excessive. I doubt I'm supplying that much. This should have been a Mark whatever way sooner, I'm guessing. Yeah, because it's supposed to be making 9,000, not 6,000. I'm guessing a Mark II would have been plenty. Okay. We want to be on which of these lines? This line. Run over here. I could put railings on these belts if I unlock them. But I haven't fallen off those belts yet. All right, all of that. I could have labeled how much quartz I was using, but so that I can make signs. Let's make sure that I can make signs. Square sign, label sign. What do you look like? Okay, I can make the signs. I think I'm consuming an entire copper belt, or copper miner. Where is that copper miner? So we could be consuming 240 per minute. Is that how much we're consuming? Each of these wants 30. Yeah, 120. So I think there's 240 copper in. Label sign, label sign. Is this really four meters by half a meter? Three meters by half a meter. How big is this? It does go on the side. Ooh, four meters. Shenanigans. No. Select an image. Copper sheets. So we make text. Right there. Can I put two lines? A, B. We can. But I might just want one line. We want 60 per min output. That's it. Mission strength. What does this mean? Matte or glossy? Matte, probably. Select the colors. That's fine. Copy settings. Look at how bright it is. Maybe that's too bright. Maybe that's too dull. Too. Copy the settings. That's perfect. Okay, now we want to copy this. Put another right there. Paste the settings. This one should be this. Select image. 240 per min input. Except that's for the cave, not for this container, but I'm gonna say that's good. I'll remember what I was doing, maybe. Maybe I will, maybe I won't. Ideally, I would put that on a cave sign instead of on that container. This is only 0.5 meters. It's so small. You don't work. 
two meter sign is so small. We can put it up into the air. Control C. Shenanigans. Control V. Now, if only there was smart wires where I could actually read. Then I could put like what the max is and I could put what the current is. That would be so good. Okay, good stuff. I do have to come all the way over here, which is less than ideal. These should really be further up. Okay, that one is copied. Copy this, paste it. Delete this, delete this. It's beautiful. Is it actually beautiful? It's totally beautiful. Copper Cave has labels. I can remember that now. Now. I need more labels. I need a better labeling like system. So I could start writing on side. I need a billboard to keep track of like all of the inputs and outputs. I was supposed to be taking that stuff with me. We'll run it backwards. Because I don't know where I'm supposed to be going to. I'm supposed to be going to. Look at that. We already have 41 engines. To somewhere down here. Look at this. To this. You. You, you, you. I'm going to need more materials. Copper Cave. Copper Cave is where? Copper Cave is somewhere up this way. Where am I going? This is not... The hub is straight ahead, so it is like this direction, kind of. Okay. If I was the Copper Cave, I would be right... Not up here. Right. Somewhere. Right over there somewhere? Okay, is this still trying to connect to the other belt? Because it should be. Okay, this looks like death. It is still trying to connect to the other belt. This is not where I'm supposed to be. Mistakes have been made. Let's go find the copper. That looks like the copper cave. Copper cave. You need to go this way. And now we're going to have a more direct route. Route? To the copper cave. It does go through a tree. But it's a little tree. These are the motors. That means I'm getting close. It 
does kind of mean that I'm getting close. Okay. Is that it right there? I think that is. Yeah, it's that whatever thing. Assembler. Go down there. Who built this? Whose decision was this? All right, you go here. This all can get torn down. This was not a shortcut. Clean up my mess. My mess is all cleaned up, I think. Okay, cool. Now that the mess is cleaned up, let's go back over here. We do have to get plastic over here. Getting plastic over here is gonna be more of a pain. Mostly because I don't know if my total plastic input to the base is sufficient to run this. I feel like it is not, especially once computer production turns back on, which will happen whenever I start. It might already still be on. It should still be on. There's no way I filled the box with computers. Okay, good jump. All right, plastic. Where are you, plastic? Plastic comes in from the cliff. From right there. Why is one of those completely empty? That concerns me. That does concern me. I kind of want to look at my power seeing that. Power, 1650. I wonder if stuff is getting backed up. I know we're at 100% battery, but I feel like it should be at 1800 more of the time. Hmm. I kind of want to go look. Although, I should be clearing out rubber now. I'm going to have to expand the plastic anyways. What's my health at? I'm dead. I am dead. Recording's at 53 minutes. That's fine. We can get down there safely. This time, I will use the power pole to go down. But I don't have a good way up that power pole still. which is a problem. Get up the power pole. Also, I'm not good at jumping and grabbing this. It's not even hard to do. But for some reason, I have trouble with it. Nope, don't die. Okay, we're good. Where was this crate? If I was a crate, I would be Right above here. Okay. I would like to get up onto this platform. There's the crate. Maybe the graphics aren't a problem with like this. We'll see. They're not bothering me now. All right. So now I want to find out why my plastic is slowed down. There's no way that, hey, plastic is running again. The rubber could have backed up. 
and now it could be getting consumed quick enough because I'm consuming 30 per minute. So the real question is if my fuel thing is backed up. By which I mean, is this backed up? Ooh, that's a lot. I should just flush the whole system, but I want to come look at the big storage and see what it looks like. Okay, my health is not that high. We're fine. Big storage. So these... Heavy oil residue. What is it that I'm looking at right now? These are refineries. Recipe. They turn heavy oil into fuel. You're the thing that I care about. This is not overfilling. The fuel is probably empty. But if the rubber was backed up, I wouldn't expect these to be overfilling. So really, I want to go look and see if the rubber container looked like it was overfilling. I think. The rubber container is over here. This one? It does not look like it was overfilling. These aren't overfilling. Nothing looks like it's overfilling. Well, except for these pipes. These pipes do look like they're overfilling. Huh. Why? Flow rate is zero. Configure valve. Valve limit, 300. Flow rate. Okay. Is this valve facing the wrong direction? I like that it has a visual indicator. Flow rate, 300 out of 300. seems so weird. I do think that I already have a valve further down the system. I remember setting up two and being curious if that could like screw things up. My health is not that high. Don't take big jumps. So this one is the fuel thing. Which wasn't empty. Oh, because I was still getting some fuel from these, I bet. Which is why I had two of those valves. Is that why? Okay, all of these give their output. All of their output goes into this. You. No. This is all of the input. The output comes out this side. They all connect. They go to this. Which is good. We have lots of flow. That connects... This is that downhill one. 
Is that true? So this, one-way valve. Not much flow. Fluid buffer. Lots of flow. There shouldn't be this much total purple anyways. 10 per minute. So total, we're only talking about one, two, three, four here, and then probably another six up there. We're talking about like under a hundred meters per minute. Like I should be able to go through or transport all of this heavy oil residue, no problem. Plastic per minute, these are making Eighty per minute. Am I making more than 120 if everything is running full speed? Also, let's look at the power again. The power did go up. That valve was screwing up my day. So this is making 80. How much plastic are these making? You. So total, I'm making 120 plastic now. Should be. How much rubber am I making? I should make a sign that says this. Rubber. We could be making 40 rubber per minute. Do I think I am? I should be. <laughs> I should be. Residual rubber. Why? Did I never hook this up? It looks like I never hooked that up. And this is only at 72% though. Why is this? You make a bunch of heavy oil. 20 rubber per minute. I am currently burning through 30 rubber per minute. Wait. What is your problem? Residual rubber. Oh, that's not the right recipe, is it? Select recipe. Rubber. That is the correct recipe. Now I could be making 40 rubber per minute, which will make 40 of this. That's okay. I should still be able to process that. Or at least, like, store it. Why is there a stupid present here? Okay. We're good. We got a bunch of rubber coming. That's okay, because that would have just been backing up the system earlier. It was not necessary. Okay, so once we come up here. These all combine right here. I would like a sign. Four meter sign. You should say, and we're going to put you as a two, select image. Okay. One. What have I done? Select two. Select image. Select image. Come here. 120 per min. Did my Discord just beep? I feel like it just did. Okay. 120 per minute. Copy settings. I should also have signs for the oil being generated, but that's... Is that tough to figure out? It's really not. Okay, this one is supposed to be rubber. Rubber looks like... Search rubber. Rubber looks like that. Select image. 
this. 40 per min. There's a layout? Huh. I could put it in the center. We'll keep it over on the left for now. Cool. I like that. So this one is going to be the purple stuff. I'm producing... Forty plus. How much do those other ones? Um. So it's twenty plus twenty. That's forty per min. And then it's ten per plastic thing. How many of the plastic things do I have? Two here, and then four down there. Sounds right. Let's just make sure that these each make twenty plastic per minute. 20 plastic per minute. 10 of this. So 6 of those. So 60. So we're making 100 per minute of this. Which I should figure out how much fuel I can turn that into. Just so that I know, like, how balanced is this system? How often do I have to come up here and drain it? Health is almost back to full. That means I could take fall damage. So these, these refineries can handle 60 per minute. Oh no. So they produce two thirds of 100 per minute. So 66.6. .6 66.7 fuel per minute. Should be how much fuel per minute I can get. That fuel is being stored where? Fuel is being stored right here. So I should be able to produce more than I create of the heavy oil residue. Which is good. That is a thing that I want. So this should never build up too much. These should always just be waiting on... Residue? 57%. Weird. 100%. I wonder if that's because of this thing's height. And if it needs a pump. Or if as... No, I think this is correct. That's what I would expect. So now the question is, how much do each of these use? They use 12 fuel per minute. And how many of them did I build? Also, gold slug. Hello, gold slug. Not enough space. If I was my space, I could throw out these flowers. Okay. I have four of these. Four of these. I could burn through 48. Wow, I do not burn through all of the fuel. Huh. I could put the power things into these to burn through more fuel. Do I have power shards on me? I don't see them. But I do miss those things quite a bit. 48. If I doubled this, we'd go up to 60. That would almost burn through all of the fuel. Okay, I would like to make special. 
No. Production. Equipment workshop. Craft workbench. Craft workbench? Where are the power things? These. Not enough space in inventory. You get space. I should have thrown those things. What do you mean, not enough? We should have enough space. No! I should have thrown whatever these things are. The heavy plates. How do I get to my inventory tab? Oh, rubber could go in the trash. No, why did I throw rubber in the trash? Whatever, doesn't matter. Craft. That was it. The two of those. So now, if I put one of these in here, 225, 3.3 seconds, 18 fuel per minute. Twenty-four. So now we should burn through 60 fuel per minute. And I should be producing 67. I don't currently need, but I don't really want my system backing up either. Okay, control C, control. Control C, control V. Control V. Now, we want to edit this one. Select image. This should be this. Cool. Do we have one for power? Oh, we do. Purple slugs. Um... It's not about how much power I'm producing. Consumes 60 fuel per minute. I like it. Is that good? Why is my plastic not actually producing 120 per minute? That is the biggest question. What are you doing? You're at 100%. You're at 100%. These appear to be at 100%. Because we expect 80 plastic per minute. That looks like 80 plastic per minute. Connector between these two is limited to 60 per minute. I understand. We've fixed it. Totally fixed it. Of course, I could just speed up that one belt. That's not what we're choosing to do. This should result in two full belts. Figured it out. I feel good with that. All right, I wanna go back to my base. Am I trying to hook up the pla- I would like to get everything hooked up so that, what are we at? We're at an hour and 14 minutes. Okay, my way up is over here. 
I want to get it all hooked up. All we have to do is get the plastic hooked up and then two more things. What were the two more things? Oh no. The plastic was just... We're not even close. And I have to figure out the computers. I can't do that all today. But upping the plastic should help a ton. That needed to be fixed. And that should help my fuel. We can take a look at the fuel. You there. 2100 and it's steady. And it should stay steady as long as, as long as what? I should end up with excess fuel as long as rubber or plastic don't build up. Rubber should eventually build up. I should be producing 10 more rubber than I consume. Really, I should be storing that stuff into a container over here. Where does it come up? Rubber comes up. I thought it came up right here. I'm so confused. Oh, it comes up over here? Yes, it does. Um, could I just add a storage container onto those belt lines? I know it's ugly, but can I do it? And they're too close together to be able to do three of them. I just want to know if I can. Organization. We want industrial storage. No, you totally can't do that. You should be able to. If it has, like, a straight path, you should totally be able to do that. But it makes sense that you can't. Okay. Hmm. I'm thinking about it. It's not like that's necessary, but at a future point, it would be good. And for the rubber, it would be good. Because look at this, the rubber is already backed up. The rubber's backed up because this isn't actually consuming the rubber. I do think I should make rubber storage. I don't think this is the great, a great long-term place for it, which really means I shouldn't put it here, but whatever. This is what I'm choosing to do. Floor is too steep. We could just cheat. I will just cheat. That doesn't look that steep. That looks perfectly reasonable. What have I done? Okay, you. You can go into the top one. You. Connect onto there. Is that correct? Yeah, totally correct. There comes the rubber. Sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. I did not connect up the plastic to my new one. Okay, tomorrow, I am going to play more of this. And we're gonna get this... I just want these going. Heavy modular frames, circuit boards, automated wiring, computers. I think I can just plug in all the existing stuff that I have, except for the circuit boards, which require the plastic, which is very doable. That doesn't even seem hard. I feel like we should just do it. It does eat a good amount of plastic. I think I'm just going to do it. Computers, modular frames, automated wire. Oh, the automated wiring's a pain to run over here as well. All right, we'll do that next time. For now, 
that does it for this episode. Thanks for watching.